Sean Greco. Do you have any other interesting bar stories, maybe even a Scotty story you'd like to share? Uh, I got a Sky story actually. Uh, last year, he uh, same idea. He was passing through Toronto, so he gave me a call. He said, "You know, I'm sticking stick around for a day. Maybe we'll do some golfing." So I picked him up at the airport, and we went and we were golfing. And, and he's always, uh, you know, just a little bit ahead of me. And he, so he's, he had me by a couple strokes, and we're on the uh, I think it was like the 16th part three, about 150 yards or so. And so I had the honors for finally for one of the holes, and so I plopped one in, and it was about you know a foot and a half, two feet maybe. Uh, so I'm like all kind of cocky and yeah, you know, finally I got him, finally, you know what I mean? And uh, sure enough, he shoots it and I'm like, oh, it's going to be close. And just kind of sucked back a bit and he got inside me by about two inches. And I just kind of looked at him and I'm like, why you always got to be that guy? You're always that guy, always right inside me or right above me or something. And he just kind of looks at me and says, sit down, Junior, and just walks away. <laughs> yeah, so. That's Scotty for you, so. <laughs> other than having to deal with Scott, are there any other bad parts about this? <laughs> <laughs> other than meeting you? No. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for your time today, Sean. Good luck in the, your, your future competitions and working in Barcelona. No, 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 I want to hear some screw up stories. I don't have any screw up stories. I never screw up. What are you talking about? It's always the porter's fault. So uh, I have one little one that actually happened about uh, six months ago. I had a, uh, had a four glass stack working and. Uh, so I'm flipping around and I'm trying not to rattle anything so it's going to fall and we have a lot of stuff hanging around our bar and like different lights and plastic things hanging around and thank God it was for some regulars of mine they were sitting there and I threw up a vodka bottle and I guess I threw it a little too high and it kind of hit what was hanging down and the bottle came straight down on all four glasses, shattered everything all over the place and they just kind of were like, oh, and I was like, I just walked away. I'm like, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> so, yeah. Blame the poor, of course, Where always. Where you work, Sean? Uh, I work at Jack, Ast Jack Astor's. It's a restaurant chain, uh, mostly in Ontario. We got some in the states and in Calgary as well. And uh, they're, you know, 100% for the flair. Uh, cool. all, all the Jack's bartenders flip bottles. We have our own uh, international competition every year as well. And yeah, they're really supportive of it. They're supportive of me competing as well, which is which is great because I mean it's a lot of money when you start competing on the international level. It's traveling all over the world. And, and thanks to guys like Scotty and and Jacks, they they always help us out and sponsor us and stuff like that, so it's terrific.